What's up, Film Jammers? Today, we've got an exclusive look at the all-new Lawa Proteus 2x anamorphic lens. Now, this lens is competing directly with the Atlas Orion anamorphic lenses, so we put together a side-by-side -side comparison comparing flaring, bokeh, sharpness, breathing, and more. But first, let's take this Lawa 45mm anamorphic lens out for a spin on, say, the Alexa Mini to see what it can do. Meet me on the rooftop balcony, folks. Mm -hmm. Film I was pretty happy with how the footage from this lens looked. I mean, it was sharp, even wide open. The colors were nice. I really liked the bokeh. But let's see how it stacks up against one of the industry standard two times anamorphic lenses in our Lawa Proteus, Proteus 45 millimeter versus Atlas Orion 40 millimeter showdown. Never seen nothing like this before. Never seen nothing like this. Never seen nothing like this before. Never seen nothing like this.
All right, so who are these Lawa Proteus anamorphic lenses for? Well, coming in at a price point less, a lot less, than the Atlas Orion anamorphic lenses, I think Lawa is taking direct aim at Atlas. This is a big deal because with the Proteus, you can get a workable three lens set for under $15,000. This now opens up the pricing to many more owner ops. I think we're gonna be seeing a lot of anamorphic content this year. Let's talk about distortion. Now the Atlas has convex, while the Proteus has concave distortion. This is a personal preference. I personally like the convex, where it looks almost bulbous. Now the concave distortion squishes inward. You can see this on a lens chart. Personally, I couldn't really notice it when we shot our short film, but if you're looking at charts and if you're looking at architecture, you will notice this more. Let's talk about focal lengths. The Atlas Orion series offers more focal length options with eight lenses. The 21 millimeter, 25, 32, 40, 50, 65, 80, and 100 millimeter. Proteus will launch with four lenses, a 35, 45, 60, and 85, which to me is still a nice set. Lawa offers nice sharpness wide open, maybe even a little sharper than the Atlas, and solid build quality, which has been missing from a lot of other low-cost anamorphic options. If you want to pre-order the Proteus lenses, you'll be able to get them at lawasina.com, and I'll put a link below to that. I think Lawa is going to give Atlas a run for their money. I personally own the Atlas 2x anamorphic lenses, and to me, this is the first lens in this price range that has really come close to what Atlas is offering. And I even prefer the Proteus on some of these side-by-side -side shots too. But what did you think? Let us know down in the comments. I'm Christian with Film Jams, and we'll see you next week. We can do some film down in the comments, or film... Christian.